Now we'll assemble the threaded rod portion of the X-carve. The first thing you'll do is hand thread the Delrin nut onto the threaded rod. You want to bring the Delrin nut up and down the entire length of the threaded rod a few times to loosen up the nut. If you have a drill handy, you can do this very easily by sticking the threaded rod into the chuck of the drill and spinning the nut up and down the rod. After the nut has traversed the length of the threaded rod a few times, leave it about halfway down and thread one of the M8 hex nuts about an inch and a half to two inches down the threaded rod. Next, you'll take the side of the threaded rod with the hex nut on it and push it through the flanged bearing. It should slide through fairly easily. You'll put a second hex nut onto the threaded rod and screw it down the length of the pulley. Check to make sure that it's the length of the pulley by setting the pulley on the threaded rod on top of that hex nut. The threaded rod should be flush with the top of the pulley. Next, you'll want to snug up the bottom hex nut all the way to the bearing without changing the position of the top hex nut on the threaded rod. You'll want both of these nuts to be very tight against the flange bearing. Once the hex nuts are tightened, put the pulley back on the threaded rod, insert the set screws, and tighten them all the way down.